left New Smyrna Beach to take a little trip over here to go to see Wilbur Beach. Next to Ponds Inlet. Oh, here's one with a with a had stuff. Oh, where the proceed to the route. Right. Can you see this? Yeah. Oh, this thing is still. So we're here over here at Wilbur Beach. After coming off from um, New Smyrna Beach, not too far away. Maybe what, 20, 30 minutes away. Here's some of the stuff you'll see. The storm damage from the last hurricane firm and stuff. Yeah, you see a lot more damage here. This side of it took the brunt compared to some of the other ones. But it's pretty good. It's not as you know, it's not as crowded. But be relaxed. So here's a nice one. Most people don't come to. Make some money left there. Glasses on the steps. It's still like a quiet spot. Yeah. So you can walk this. You can go either way. That way or this way. Let's take a look this way. So you see all the stuff on the side. Remember the stuff we showed you? Things knocked down. All the houses that are not that are that destroyed that are damaged. I'm gonna go behind here. So look at it. This is from the last storm damage. Where like all the houses in the back kind of collapsed. What we saw. I came here like a little bit after it happened, and I didn't really um, get a chance to film it. I always wanted to come out and see that. Could you imagine? Let's look at this. So this is you know in homes for the beach. And I'm getting this is like safety. It's storm water. Say it was breaking. The force of it, but. That was some powerful storm and wave that came across here. So, I don't hate it so much. Oh, look at this. Wow. Look at this. Like this anymore. Look at this. Now, if your home was here and then storm passed through and everything gets damaged like this, you know, listen, things are beautiful and nice, but the reality is that this is life and this is simply personified to people's lives in general. Things are wonderful at one point and then situations come and damage and you know life still goes on i mean you look around you you know things are still happening around you life is still going on but it's like these people's lives are turned on you maybe it's a vacation home but it's somebody's place you know so oh, oh, we don't we don't know i mean we heard about it when the storm was hitting how it was damaged and stuff so we don't know it's just that this is just the aftermath this is way after, months after, I mean. So a lot of it, it was worse back then. I think they put up, this was still leaning when the last time we came, right? But here, they put, see they did some reinforcement here. I didn't notice this the last time. So, you know, and I, I feel for these people here. I mean, just don't have a property, a place to go. Beachfront property, but this is what can happen too. And look at the soil below, there's a lot of sand and stuff. I mean, thank God we didn't hear about sinkholes and stuff, you know? But yeah, look at, look at all the root system. This is like, you know, I call this personified as life. You have your home, you have your life built upon sand and other things. On concrete and rocky, you stand a little firmer, but on this kind of surface, it's bound to give way at some point if forces knock it over. But at the same time, you see the entire, you see the, you know, roots are, roots are grafted there. Wow. Look at the sand still. Beautiful shells in the sand too. It's amazing. Oh, so, no, you got some video. I didn't know you were <laughs> let's, take, let's take a walk down here. Let me see a little more. Come. Take a little, a little further walk. Come. So I'm just watching the side. So one side, if you can hear the nice sound, beach on one side. On the other side, it just... <laughs> 